Hi guys, I just thought you might like to see how my Victorian mansion transformation is coming along. So in the hallway here, I'm going to take out this bit of wall here and I'm going to put uh, two archways down this hallway uh, with like plaster moulding and everything. Um, so and then we're going to um, put nice cornice in here, some ceiling roses and, uh, and we're going to rip up all the carpets and we're going to uh, stain and polish the floorboards. We've got Baltic pine under here. Uh, they're all in good nick, which is good. So yeah, that job should be easy. So follow me through. While the music is still playing Let's dance While the floor is still swaying This moment will never come again Let's dance while the music's playing. This moment will never, ever come again. So let's dance for the sweet love we found. So the next thing up was cutting these pocket doors in. So there was a door around about here. So I cut that whole wall out, built these pocket doors and uh, they slide beautifully. Look at that. So um, that just goes into our lounge room at the moment.
So the first thing in this transformation, behind this wall here is the pantry. So I extended the pantry out this way and I built the little niche there with the arch above. And I also cut this arch. There was a door just here, which uh, I'm not sure if you can see in the original hallway shot. So there was a door there. So the next thing up was removing this wall that was across here. So there was a door in there and just a blank panel above. So I removed that wall and we pulled up the carpet and the underlay along the hallway. And then the next thing up was to remove this wall along here. So there was a wall that went all the way along here with a door just here. So this has opened up the parlor and uh, given us an entry into the parlor and yeah it's uh coming along pretty nice and uh it's going to be a nice spacious parlor over here um this is where another set of pocket doors is going so that's uh yet to be cut through obviously and pocket doors made
So next up, we've got building this entry. So I did a bit of a test run and I put up some walls and we had a look at it and there was mixed feelings about whether it was going to look good or not. But after Marvin did the drawing and he added this little opening here with an arch in it, uh, it made it clear to me that that was the way to go. It was going to look really good. So I've, made, I've built those walls. I've made this arch up and put that there and it's got all the chamfered corners going up here, you can see. So yeah, it's got all the works and jerks on.
So then next up was building these little nibs here. So I built these walls and these are 400 wide. So nice and big. That really makes it look like a substantial brick wall through there. So uh, that was the idea. And then I built these arches and put them up.
So lastly, we've started putting up some of the corners and we've got the ceiling rose, which won't have a light in it. It's just decorative. And then we've got the rope battens that go along with the rose pattern. They call them bosses, but um, they're just corner blocks to me. So yeah, so that's how it will all look. Lastly, guys, we've got a new color scheme that we're trying out. So let us know in the comments, gray or maroon.